Greetings, Earthlings. My name is Christopher Hart. I'm a cartoonist, your cartooning Sherpa, and the author of many books on how to draw cartoons. You can see my work on my website, ChristopherHartBooks.com. And today, I'd like to show you how to draw a very exaggerated character. Now, the characters today are always trying to push the envelope, character design-wise, especially on television. And one thing I think is really funny is that sometimes you'll see a character whose, whose head is completely submerged into the shape of the body. And that's what I'm going to do, do today, show you how to exaggerate that. So here's the shape. Here's the basic shape, which you can follow along with. As you can see, this is all body and head. So we're, we're going to put the eye line here. That's where the eyes go. Maybe a little bit higher up, like this. And I'm going to just show the back of the head like so. Just give a little bit of definition. Okay, now I'll put the eyes right here, really kind of wacky eyes close together. Actually, I'll make them up and down eyes. That, that looks even goofier. See, like this, tall ovals. Looking right at us. Like so. Let's float those eyebrows, which is another really wacky look. A little shading in between. And we'll give a little bit of a bridge of the nose here. A gigantic honker of a nose. And a wild smile. Let's bring that mouth down really low, but we're gonna bring a tongue out right here. See like that? Notice that we actually, we always draw the inside of the mouth also. It comes in like that, like it stretches. It should look very rubbery. Like the ears here. Let's blacken those in. Gives a nice contrast the black areas with the white areas. They're wiggly, which makes them look extra goofy. I'm going to put his arm down here, a little arm, straight down by the side. Here's the paw. There's the little fingers there. Actually, I'm going to aim it down a little more rather than parallel to the ground. There we go. Let's round that off. Let's put a little indentation at the top, a little like that. And let's square that off, just to be extra goofy. Uh, I think I'll round off that bottom here. Little feet. Let me give him a little bit more tummy. Why not, huh? And I think I'll give make this leg a little thinner. Skinny quality gives a nice contrast to the gigantic stomach. Make that a little longer. Let's have him saying hello. And so I think I should make this also a little bit goofier. How about we give him a pocket? <laughs> you gotta love a dog that has a pocket, right? If dogs had pockets, they would rule the world. A couple of pieces of hair sticking up. Now, that is an exaggerated dog character. So there are a lot of different things you can do for exaggeration, but you have to actually, it doesn't happen by itself. The, the, the message is that you have to really think about each area. Anyway, that's my stuff. I'm grateful that you are one of my Facebook fans, readers, and YouTube fans. So thank you, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. I'm the author of many popular how-to-draw books on everything from cartooning to manga. 
I upload new videos each week, so please subscribe and enjoy.